There is a new bright comet in the night sky, and you can see during the near the dusk times, near the sunrise. It was discovered by the Hideo uh, Nishimura, who is from the city of the Kakigawa in the Japan. On the Saturday, 12th of August, this comet is going to be bright. At the moment, is a uh, is a little bit away from the sun at around uh, one astronomical uni uh, unit. That is around 150,000. Uh, one million kilometers, one hundred fifty million kilometers. Uh, it will be closer to the sun up to sun up to uh, one fifth of that. That's around uh, yeah thirty million kilometer. But during that time, it will be too close to the sun, so we cannot see it. The best time to see it is from now, right now. If you have a clearer sky, early morning in the Gemini constellation, you can see it up to the twelfth of the September. This is the chart that you can use to find it. It's very easy at the moment. It's just down there in Gemini beside the Castor and Pollux, those two bright stars in the Gemini constellations. Just go from the uh, Alpha Gemini to Beta and then go down. You will see it. It's very easy. It will continue to have a you know curve on the sky. At the moment, it's very bright. You see the range of the observation for one day, how bright it was. So it's getting by the hour brighter and brighter. It has to cover that distance and get closer to the sun. So it's really moving fast. As you can see in this sequence of images, it's getting brighter. It has a green tinge. It will be bright. And uh, it's because it has a cyanide gas in it. So practically, uh, greens glows a little. Also oxygen and other ionized particles. You can photograph it. You can observe it. Don't forget, use your binoculars. You can, with the binoculars, it will be really easy. I have a video about how to observe it with a small telescope and photograph it with a uh, camera. Discover, discover it with a camera also. You just use the DSLR with the telephoto lens. Watch this video which is about the comet ZDF. It will be useful as a guide what to do. Okay, I'm now looking at the constellation Auriga. And the star you can see at the center of the field is the Capella Alpha Origa and slightly to the 4 o'clock of that is the Comet C 2022-E3ZTF I will show you how it looks like through the telescope this is the uh, Skywatcher ED72 uh, of a chromatic telescope that I'm using and this is the Zeiss uh, 25 mm 57 degrees eyepiece uh, this is the Zeiss um, PL 10 times oh, 10 times dash 20 let's see how is the view through this telescope I will take astrophoto of this Okay, I'm now taking the pictures of the comet uh, ZTF, which is near the Capella in the Auriga, Alpha Auriga, and as you can see, it's quite easily visible. It's 15 seconds, and uh, at ISO, I think f f 2500 or 600. 